this is Morgan with Morgan Burke's Photography and Product Shop. And today I'm going to show you how to correct um, backlit ears. As you can see, his ear here is a little bit um, blown out and kind of bright and saturated. So today we're going to fix that up. Um, so the first thing that we're going to do on your photo is just open a new blank layer. And I'm going to do that by hitting the little sheet of paper icon at the bottom of my layers panel. Um, and when this pops up, it's already highlighted. So what you're going to do is you're going to click where it says normal and you're going to change this. This is the blend mode. You're going to change it to the color blend mode. Okay. And next, what we're going to do is make our brush a little smaller. And I'm doing this with the right bracket key, or sorry, the left bracket key on my keyboard. And that makes your brush smaller. And I'm just going to zoom in here. And with my brush, I'm going to hold down my alt key, or you can hold down your option key if you're on a Mac. And I'm just going to click the regular tone of his skin. You can choose the rosier part of the cheek or maybe just by the side of the head, um, whichever you prefer. And you can play around with this and see which one looks best. And then what I'm going to do here is just paint this on. And my brush opacity is set to 10. You can raise that up if you'd like. Um, if you raise it up, go to maybe 40%. Um, and just start painting that in there and you'll see that it takes away that saturation and makes the ear look a little more um, flesh toned like it should so and um, if you notice that it looks a little bit desaturated you can add some shadows and stuff in there uh, to make it look a little more believable but for a quick fix this is super simple um, and here you can see his fingers have a little bit of the back the backlit effect too so you can select a color of his hand if it doesn't match the one that was on his face and then just paint those over the fingers a little bit just to make sure that your eye doesn't go directly towards those um, super bright fingers there. there. And if you go a little too far with this, you can always come over here to this layer and just lower the opacity a little bit if you feel like that makes it look more normal. Just be careful not to go too far or you'll undo all the work you just did. So I hope this helped. If you have any questions, you can email me at morgan at morganburks.com or you can find me on Facebook at facebook.com slash morganburksphotography. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.